Welcome one and all to the Brew Barons. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today I'm heading into the danger zone. Not only is my brewing business at risk of going under, as my bank account goes to nothing, but I also put my life on the line, taking on a massive pirate zeppelin. Can I avoid bankruptcy and a permanent retirement? Let's find out in the Brew Barons. All right, here we go with some more of the Brew Barons, and I've been having a ton of fun with this aerial adventure game, and there are two specific things that I want to get done in this video. Now, if you want to check this game on out, I'll have a link in the description down below where you can do just that. But for now, let's get right into it and continue. The first thing that I want to do is to check out one of the pirate zeppelins. Last time we found the floating market, which is a trading zeppelin, but I want to see what the pirate ones are all about. And if things are a bit too dangerous, we can always hightail it out of there now that I got a super fast airplane. The second thing that I want to do is try to unlock the story mission for our lovely pilot and co-pilot here. I think we just need to get enough airtime with the both of them in the plane. And of course, what better way to get some airtime than to go around the islands hunting for some pirate zeppelins. It does look like our hold is practically full. So we probably want to empty that out. Let's go into the hangar here and transfer everything in our plane to the brewery. And we might as well put this into our bar to sell. All right, there we go. Very nice. Let's head on out and uh, wait a minute. Actually, let us come over here and pretty much every episode so far, I've changed the color of my plane. So might as well keep up with tradition and add a new paint job for this episode. Uh, we're wasting so much money on paint, but we're going to look awesome. So what do we want here? Oh, indigo. Not bad. Bright orange, maybe. Yellow. Red, we already had. Uh, ooh, teal. Ooh, I kind of like teal. That looks nice. Uh, the trim. What do we want on, on the trim? Orange. Oh. Maybe indigo. Kind of have a understated kind of look or white even uh no i think i like i like the indigo let's go with that and then switch the cockpit oh there it is and then oh wait a minute how much money do we have oh we, we don't have a lot we're gonna spend all of this uh pontoon can i change this i can uh propeller do i have oh no i don't have enough okay we're going to keep the the nose of the airplane here as amber and the rest as that. I'm going to purchase this. And there we go. <laughs> We're spending definitely spending all our money on paint. We have to find some more contracts so we can earn a living. And I don't think there's any... No, there's nothing pending yet so far. So we do need to find some more bars that might need some of our services. But let's get us up in the air. Throttle up. How fast can I boost into the air? Oh, super fast. Oh, I love this plane. This plane is great. All right, where are we? Oh, look at that. There's something way over there. And there's another Zeppelin. That might be... That one might be the trading Zeppelin. Something there. Uh, oh, something way over there, too. This one, though. This one right here kind of looks different a bit. Is that an actual Zeppelin? I don't know. Uh, well, only one way to find out. Let's hit the boost. See how fast we can go. 600, 700, 800, keep it going, 900, oh, okay, we top out around somewhere 900, but that is just great. I love the speed on this uh, particular fuselage that we bought last time. Of course, I have barely any control while we're boosting like this, and my water tank is almost empty, so I'm going to have to grab some more. There we go. Come on down. 
Oh, is this a bottle? Oh, it is a bottle. Apple grain wine. Oh, there was this. Oh, there's a shipwreck over here. Oh, okay. I don't have time for that. I'll come back for you. Oh, but there's a bottle over here. Oh, and a bottle on the, on the right as well. Oh, another shipwreck? Wow. This is not a safe place for ships at all. Twin grape wine. Oh, ivy grape and pearl grape. I totally have those. Uh, oh, yeah, that one on the left. Uh, that is definitely the trading one. I can see the cranes on the top. That one there is different. What? Wait a minute. What island are we at? Oh, we're at Haver. Oh, wait, there's a... Oh, this here. There's a relic. Uh, not a relic. There's a, a ruin here that I didn't know how to activate last time we were here, but now I do. I just kind of have to put my reticle over it. There we go. Excellent. Tomb of Melid. An ancient resting place for military leaders long ago. The damp, dark walls that encase these figures are draped in cobwebs and lined with a near-endless list of engraved names of their loyal soldiers that perished while defending the Adley Bay from invading warlords. Oh, very cool. I think that's... Is that related to the... The statue, the warrior statue that we found on one of the other islands? Okay, uh... We're not going to mess with the shipwrecks just yet. This zeppelin over here definitely looks different. All right, boost on in. Uh, oh, there's an island here. Is that a uh, another ruin? Perhaps kind of ease our way to the left here. Okay. Okay let off it is another ruin oh and there's a there's a recipe here we were coming in super fast I've spotted, um, something. It's right over there. dark moon shrine for centuries this shrine has been a topic of unsolved mysteries and evil rituals though the most popular tale of all would be the moonlight maiden that shows up at night a ghostly woman waiting for her fiancé to return from the sea that claimed his life. It's been said she watches all who approach and is hostile towards living men. Oh, geez, don't crash into it. Okay, we're good. All right, come down here. Refill and boost over. This thing doesn't look... Oh, another sh a wreck. Or we're not messing with that right now. This thing does not look friendly. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. Are you a pirate ship? Uh, I don't see any pirate markings. The island of Capliff. Oh, Sir Mavery. Oh, you got a skull next to you. You're definitely a pirate. Uh, hey, how you doing? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just flying by, just taking a quick look. Don't mind me. Oh, geez. Okay, evasive. Okay, uh... Okay, can we, uh... Take you on? Can I hit you? Oh, switch to guns. Can I get your, uh, engines out? Oh, jeez. Okay, they got four and aft turrets. They got machine guns down here. Okay. Uh, oh, they're firing something out of the bottom. They got, like, turrets on the bottom as well. Okay, evasive. Just fly around in circles. Let's see if we can get these, these turrets here. Oh no, watch out. Oh, what was that? Are you spitting out balloons? Oh, it totally spit out a balloon. Oh gosh, and they got cannons on them. Oh, get a lock. Take you out. 
get wrecked. Excellent. Oh, this is definitely in over our head. Oh, no. Okay, I need, I need these turrets gone. Oh, gosh. Okay, I have missiles. I have missiles. Let's come back around. Get a good target lock. Right here. Oh, jeez. Nope. Wait, can I not? I can't get a target lock on that. Uh, what about these machine guns? Where are they? Here? On this thing? Oh, yeah, there they are. Okay. Watch out. Alright. Fire. Fire. I'm not getting a hit marker on that either. Why can't I hit that? What can I... Oh, wait. What is that? There's a big hole underneath it. Oh, do I got to shoot in there? Oh, do I got to fly in there? Oh, no. It looks like I can fit. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Come back around. Oh, this is a big mistake. I'm going to die. I'm going to die trying to do this. Oh, wait. We got a target lock on something. What's in here? Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, look at that. Fire, fire. Oh, we're going all Death Star 2 on this thing. Oh, excellent. Okay, but I am out of water. I need to refill. We're taking too much damage, too. Okay, there were like two more of those in there. Oh, jeez. Okay, don't sit still. Kind of move around. Serpentine, serpentine. Oh, gosh. Try not to crash into the water, either. Okay, come back around for another pass. Uh, oh, wait a minute. It's closed. Wait, wasn't it open? Didn't we just fly out of there? Watch out. Oh, man. Okay, hold on. Oh, there are way too many balloons here. We need to get rid of all of these. Okay. Oh, look at that. We got you on fire. Excellent. Ooh, jeez. Just kind of back and forth. All right, coming around. Let's try this again. Missiles online. It's going to fire, isn't it? Watch out. Okay, we're good. Oh, man, I'm going to crash into the side of this here. Launch missile missiles. Oh, don't hit the... Oh, they just... Oh, gosh. Okay, uh, that was not that was not productive. Let's fly up and over. To try and avoid the machine guns on the sides. Okay, maybe I got to hold off on trying to get a lock until a little bit later. Not so early when we enter uh, the bowels of the beast. Alright, coming back around and down. Alright, here we go. Oh, gosh. Another run. Careful, careful. Oh, it's moving. I get a lock. Lock on. Hit that one. Oh, gosh. Okay. That's another hit. Oh, yes. Look at your health bar right there. They're hitting the main circuit. Stop them, you fools, or we're done for. Oh, you're burning even more now. Excellent. Okay, one more hit. Oh, jeez. We're doing good. I got your number now. Uh... It's your number two. All right, reload our missiles. Should be reloaded by the time we come back around. All right, here we go. All right, come in. Don't get a lock yet. Nope, not yet, not yet. 
Oh, never mind. Oh, no, it was not. It's right there. Okay, we need more water. Oh, gosh. Dangerous, dangerous being down here. Pick this up. Citrus vodka. Sounds good. I could, I could, I could use a drink right now. <laughs> Alright. Good, good, good. Coming up. How close are you? Okay, you're a ways off. We're fine. Can we fire from way out here? No. I mean, I feel like this is just gonna hit something. Just fire somewhere. Fire wildly. Right here. Oh, we got you. Is that the last one? <gasps> That's the last one. Did we get you? Are you going? I just thought it's something. Over there. Oh, you're rising. You're getting out of here. You're buzzing out. Oh, we got you. Where are you going? Get back here. Oh, excellent. Did we pick up? No, there's another thing we didn't pick up here. Grab all our materials. Oh, that was a lot of fun. That was great. Well, there's some giant mushrooms right over there. Can we grab those? But well, you're headed up into the clouds and away. Oh, man. Our first... Oh, hello, you. Are you... I can't tell how far away you are. You look like you're pretty far away. Oh, there's a plane way up there, too. Oh, there's a bunch of planes. Oh, that was... That was an awesome kind of, like, boss battle. Let's see if we can collect some of these. Now that we cleared this island. Oh, bolt level three. Okay. Oh, truffles? Is that what that said? Yeah, because where, where are we? Oh, we are way out here on the edge. Uh... This is definitely probably further out than we should be at this point in the game, perhaps. But we we dealt with that uh, dealt with that zeppelin. That was fun. Freshwater aqueducts. These aqueduct fragments were once part of a vast network used to collect and channel fresh water to other locations on the island. As techniques of collecting groundwater improved, these costly aqueducts were dismantled into materials for constructing wells and filtering systems. This is, this is an awfully small island to be constructing an aqueduct on. Alright, uh, but we do have more recipes out and about. And there's a town over there, too. We're going to go land and see if they need anything. It's probably going to be the case, though. Apple pie cider. Uh, oh, wait, why is it red? Oh, no, there. Astral spirits. It the city of Visar. It's probably going to be the case like we had in the other ones that we need more of a reputation for them to take us seriously. Power down. Oh man, we're too close. We're too close. Okay, this seems awfully close there. Let's, let's go take a look at what you, you have to say first. Cause you're like you're like right here. Do I get close to you? Oh wait, I target you. Wait, don't fire missiles. Oh. To Barons. There's a group of pirate refuel balloons rolling by. Mind shooting some of them down? Over. Uh, sure. I'll be more than happy to do that. Uh, where are they? Refuel balloons. Oh. There we go. There's 25 of them. Wait a minute. These are them, right? Are there 25 here? Oh, they're all kind of like clustered up. Okay. Oh, and we got a timer as well. Oh, no. How far are we? No hit marker. Okay, there we go. Just get a bunch of them. Excellent. All 
right, 17 to go. Oh, come on. Aim, aim. Oh, we're going to need to refill our water tank as well. Okay, we're out. Coming back down. Oh, come on. Lower. I'm running out of time. I'm running out of time. Only 11 left. We're halfway through our timer. We should be able to get this. Alright, six more. Well, there's, there's plenty more than six, right? Yes. So we don't have to get them all. Just enough. Oh, my fatigue level, my pilot, oh, is going way down. I just noticed the uh, the gray around the outside of my screen. Yeah, I'm at like 29 on my fatigue level there. That, <laughs> that, that uh, Zeppelin battle really took it out of him. Okay, two more balloons to go. We can go dock down there and rest as well. One more with a little bit of time to spare. Excellent. Oh, we got some money for that. Ooh, and a bunch of reputation as well. Three minutes and one second, a level one. All right, where is this? It's over there. That was fun. Okay, and also I just noticed over there around Marin's portrait, that green bar has filled. And I think that's the story mission, because it's got the little book next to it. So I wonder how we activate that. We might have to go home, maybe, to do that at our headquarters. All right. Bring it in nice and easy. Look at that. Perfect landing. All right, I hope you have a commission for me. Oh, there's somebody here. Uh, Irina? Um, yes? What do you want? You're not here to tease me too, are you? If you are, I just want to be left alone. I'm, I'm most likely going to offer you a job back at headquarters. Tell me about yourself. Well, my name is Irina. Not many know me, and those that do tend to keep their distance. They're put off by my claimed ability to observe spirits of the past. Really? It's not all the time. Only sometimes. I hate it. It's more of a curse. You believe me, right? Not everyone does. As a result, I live my quiet, lonesome life as a bit of a recluse. Uh, is there a ghost? Is it just me or is there a ghost floating by right now? <laughs> oh, that is totally a ghost. Okay. Uh, do you want a job? Well, that's kind of funny. I don't normally drink and rarely do I step foot in a bar. I came here because I'm tired of living like a hermit. I wanted to break free of this lonely, boring life I live in hopes to find something new. Something meaningful or exciting. So it's a funny coincidence, coming here and hearing your offer to join. In all honesty, when I spoke of wanting to find excitement, I was thinking more along the lines of trying to fly a kite or paddle a boat. So this would be quite the jump for me. I'm, um, a bit nervous, but I know this would be good for me. Who knows? It might even cleanse me of my haunting spiritual sightings. I can only hope. I'm happy to join the team. 
I mean, I don't know what uh, what kind of job I have for you at a brewery, but we're going to make it work. I guess this place is called Astral Spirits, so it makes sense that there's ghosts floating around. All right, let's talk to the owner. I sense a familiar spirit has walked into my bar. Have we met in a past life? Or perhaps your soul beacons to me as many others do. My name is Mira, owner of Astral Spirits. I welcome you. Uh, ask about contracts. I was hoping you would ask. Oh! Many spirits have visited me from all over the bay and spoke of your noble efforts. It would be a pleasure to work with you. I'll send you a contract when I can. Oh, excellent. Absolutely. Uh, sure, make some small talk. Despite my patrons not seeing nor feeling the presence of ghosts in my bar, some are uncomfortable by my claim to communicate with the wandering souls of the past. Why these spirits tend to congregate here, I am unsure. Perhaps because I display no fear and show genuine intrigue to hear their story. The amount of souls I've met, the stories I've heard, there's no bounds to the complexity, beauty, and terror of mankind. My time with these spirits have been truly an enlightening experience. I mean, I, I can totally see it. I can totally see them. Okay, let us... Oh, let's check the local news real quick. Pirate ship gathering ingredients in Pont, uh, Pont Marie. Pirate brews now in stock at the Black Barrel. A pirate submarine. A submarine has been visiting the uh, Boonich region in order to increase trade links to the area. Pirate representatives have been seen visiting the Black Barrel with the aim of securing a distribution deal. Pirate smog balloons over Cormac. Potentially hazardous. Oh man, are we going to have to fight a submarine? Let's take a look at this. Oh, what just happened? What? What was that? <laughs> oh, Jesus. How come I spawned in the air? Uh... This is going to use up all our mu- Oh my gosh. What? That was crazy. <laughs> okay. Um, you know what? Let's like repair to um, half, I suppose. Hit it on 270. Sure. Good enough. Uh, do we have enough fuel to get back home? Maybe. We do need to rest as well. Uh, let us... How long do we need to rest for? Four hours, maybe? Let's try this. Gets us back to 54. Good enough. Okay, we have four days to make a beer using fiber hops. Do I have fiber hops? I don't know. What happens if I fail? I don't know what happens if I fail a contract. Maybe our reputation goes down. Five days to complete, four days to accept. You know what? Let's just accept it. We're going to find some fiber hops somewhere. Zero to eight percent. Sure. Let's grab it. We need the money. Uh, let us... Perhaps we should refuel just a bit. Can we hit to half as well? Do we have enough money to get to half? A tank? We do. All right. Power up. And maybe we can take a look around here. Fuel check. 50% full. See if there's any... Any fiber hops around. I mean, this stuff is a bit too much for us. But maybe these things? Oh, nope, not the boost. The gun. Cinnamon bark. And then what was this? Sun cherry. Alright, anything else on this island with the truffles? Oh, well, we got some, uh, some recipes over there. I guess we can look here. Royal truffle, sun cherry. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, there are fiber hops over on Hover. Okay, we gotta head over there. Anything else? No, and I think the ones, these ones here we haven't visited yet, so we can't see what those are. 
Oh, we are way too close to this. Pick that up. Tame Cherry Cider. Using the Sun Cherries that we can't grab. And at one star. All right, let's see if we can get this without breaking the bottle. Oh, there we go. Oh no, I did it again. Okay, I don't know how... I don't know how we get that without breaking it. All right, where are we headed? We're headed to Haver over here. I wish I could set like a pin on the map and then have it show up on probably my compass at the top. All right, uh, I think, oh, a recipe. I'll grab this. Nice eyes. Oh, okay, nice eyes, but poor flying by me. Spiced Spud Vodka. All right, make sure I'm headed in the right direction. No, I'm not. Right there. Okay, switch to our boost. And let's get going. To make sure okay yes that is definitely the island there pick up some more water Alright, now I'm pretty sure I've been around this island, and I don't remember seeing or grabbing any fiber hops. Because this is Dandewheat here. Uh, yeah, Daco Nuts, Pearl Grape, oh, Vanilla Reeds I haven't seen here either. Those are the Daco Nuts. Oh, there's another mission up there. Ooh, a crate. These are the pearl grapes. Maybe on this little island out here. Oh, there's a recipe. Oh man, I keep feeling I'm gonna like, crash into the ocean. Diving for these. I'm gonna crash into the rocks, is what I'm gonna crash into. Go up. Honey Bear Rum. Alright, well, I don't know where these fiber hops are. Oh, geez. These things just keep <laughs> floating in from everywhere. Bitter Shroom Brandy. Oh, wait a minute. Up here? Oh, what was... I don't remember what this was. It's an ingredient. I flew through it before. I don't remember what it was called, though. Okay, let's see what this is. Oh, it is fiber hops. We need we need to upgrade our our plane though. Okay. Wait, what did it say? It said air collection. I think it was. Let me just make sure. Yep, 
air collection required fiber hops level one. Oh, but we we have no money. We spent we oh we got some extra money, but we spent it on repairs. Oh, where is that that mission? That plane that was flying around. Oh, I need that now. Spicy carrot rum. We can also sell ingredients to the farmer back at base. Oh, where's that plane? I don't see it. Oh, great. Okay. Um, let's head back to base. And maybe we can sell some stuff to the farmer. Enough to get this upgrade. I mean, we have we have several days to do it. Oh, a whale over there. I love the whales. All right. Uh Coming in a little hot. Check. Level is moderate. Yeah, we're gonna need to rest again. Oh man. Oh we can just we can swap to uh, a different pilot that has that is at full rest. Okay. Head over here. Slow down. Ooh, not that slow. Easy, easy. Oh, okay. Nope. Not easy enough. We are limping back. Oh, the mechanic is not going to be happy about this. Oh, what's going on? Uh. Damn. I messed it up. Oh, it's the it's the the story mission. Excellent. Where did I go wrong? Maybe I added too much this time. Hey, Marin, what's going on? I heard a commotion from the other room. Oh, um, hey, Kefton. Uh, yeah, it was nothing. No worries. Judging from all the crumpled notes on the ground, it looks to me like you're wrestling with a new brew. Um, well, sorta. Not exactly a new brew. It's more of an old family brew, though I'm having a hard time getting the proportions right. Is that so? Here, let me have a taste. Whoa, uh, hey, wait! Ugh. Yeah, that tastes off. Um, well, it tastes off, if I put it nicely. Hmm, yeah, I tried to warn you. I'm making this by request of the banker in town. He's fond of my old family brew and is willing to buy some if I can craft it. Oh, I need the money. And now you're up here trying to fulfill the order. I see. You know, I used to be quite the bootleg brewer. I could give you a hand. What ingredients are you mixing with? Really? Ah, oh, that would be great. Here's the recipe. Oh man, pearl grape, coffee bean, apple. Okay, we have pearl grapes and apples. I don't know about coffee bean. I know I can find coffee beans at the uh, the floating market, the trading zeppelins, but we have no money to buy it. I only need a few units for the banker. There's no time limit on this order, so fortunately there's no rush. Create uh, Marin's family recipe with Kefton as the brewer. Ooh, okay. So you specifically need to be put as the brewer. All right, but we do need to switch Kefton out because you're fatigued, 23 out of 100. Uh, expert in wind currents and gains extra speed during upward inclines. Oh, and your omission oh, partner is Navina. Oh, wait, we have somebody new, don't we? Wait, go back to the brewer. Where is Irina? Can effectively pilot the plane at low energy levels, see spooky spirits in the dark causing cockpit mishaps and reduced field repairs. Mission partners Nigel. Interesting. Okay. Um, I like that you'd be able to pilot the plane at low energy levels. Okay, you're a new pilot. And oh, then okay. Nigel, you're up as co-pilot. Uh, yeah. You want me there? Got it. 
Uh, Kefton, you're brewing. And I suppose the bar manager will be Marin. There we go. I think that's everybody. I wonder how many characters there are. Are there just eight or are there more characters than there are slots? Okay. Um, let us take a look at the map. That's what I want to do. See if there, oh, see if there's a place where we can get coffee beans. Uh, not that we found. I mean, there is the floating market. Oh, a product of war many decades ago, these airships were conceptualized to deliver massive shipments of munitions through dangerous territories. As one blimp supplied the front line, another returned with the wounded and refugees on board. With the war long over and only two remain, one named Tesca and its sister blimp Tescos, these massive blimps have been converted into a marketplace for any and all to visit. All right. Uh, well, we need to be visiting the bar and hopefully the farmer's in here. Okay, Farmer Gus. How you doing? Did you manage to collect some produce for me? Oh, yes. Uh, oh, wait. No? Goodbye? Wait, no, I do have produce. Do I need to have it in here? Uh, can I talk to you again? Can I not talk to you again? I can't click on you again. Oh no. Okay. Oh, hello, Inspector. Warm welcome to our bar. Do you fancy a drink? Why, yes. I hope you have something a little better than last time. I mean, she's in here just grabbing free drinks. Wait, you said you liked what I had last time. Thank you. Let's see how this tastes. Quite a good brew you have here. You show some promise. Latest news? I have heard that a pirate battleship is patrolling the waters at of Point Marie. Reports came in that a pirate submarine has been sighted near Tisro. They're a slippery bunch. Pirate gunships are reportedly sighted over somewhere. They're harassing anyone who tries to enter the area. Okay. Um, it looks like you can only... Like, I can't click on her again. You can only talk to them once. Hold on. If I go to, like, the brewery... And then back to the bar. Does it reset? Oh, I mean, well, it does reset and they're just gone. All right. Is bland apple cider supposed to taste of fish? Um, it is if you like it. Let's try this again. Brewery? Does it reset again? We need to make some money. Uh, back to the bar. Okay, no, they're gone. Let us... Oh, we gotta... We gotta find some contracts. We need to go to some other other islands real quick. Uh, and we can't... Hold on, hold on. We can't repair, right? Like... Damage. Hmm. You really like to put me to work around here, don't you? Yep, you don't do it for free, do you? No, you don't. Are we gonna spend it all? I don't want to take out, I really don't want to take out a loan. Let's, oh, I can't get to 70 exactly. We'll just do this. Oh no, I guess that was 70 exactly. Okay, <laughs> we are literally broke. I have run this company into the ground. I probably should have saved some for fuel, but I guess we can take a loan out if necessary. All right, let's head to this one here. And see if there's a settlement 
Hopefully there is. Oh, I just realized I put a bunch of apple into my hold to try and give to the farmer, and I didn't take it out. Okay, there's definitely something here. We've reached an island. The island of Pocket. Pocket? Oh, yeah, right there. I see the dock. Okay. Oh, I should have used the f money on fuel. All right, there it is. All right, power down. Very nice. The sea salt goblet. All right. Huh? Oh, welcome to the sea salt goblet. I'm Kenas, up and coming artist and temporary bar manager, holding down the fort while the owner is out. So, do you want a drink or something? Uh, no, I'm wondering if you want a drink. The bar owner was just talking about you barons the other day. He was interested to start accepting brew deliveries. I'll prepare an order when I hear from him. Oh, excellent. Amazing. Sure, some small the talk. The owner of this bar, he's a cranky 82-year-old geezer. And his wife. Yikes. That old battle axe is even worse. They occasionally check in, but I think they do it just to complain my ear off. I took this job because my paintings aren't really selling and oil paints ain't cheap. Who knows? Maybe someday my art will sell big and I can quit this crummy job. Uh, though people around here don't seem to appreciate my deep paintings. A crab surf and a banana. What's not to like? Sounds, uh, sounds amazing. Okay, let's, let's get this. Wait, local news? Anything new? Ooh, bartender review. M Marin, wait, what? Patrons that went to Deep Sea Brews were in for an interesting evening with a man named Marin behind the bar serving drinks. Oh, because we set him as the bartender. The self-proclaimed up-and-coming brewer had an extensive knowledge of brews and questions and questioned us about preference of beverage weight, texture, and richness, to which we stared back puzzled with no opinion on the matter. Fortunately, Marin was able to recommend some nice drinks for the evening, and we got to try something new and that we enjoyed. Oh, a lovely review for our bar. Excellent. All right, uh, we want to come over here. Contracts. You want a Dandewit beer, 58 units. Okay, I've definitely grabbed Dandewit. Okay, I think that that is the stuff that is in the airstreams over near our home base, as well as apparently it looks like the airstreams here. But there's also, oh, there's ginger hops. That's different from fiber hops. Okay, except this. Quality expected, only one star. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, power up. Let's get in the air. And grab some fiber hops. We definitely don't have a lot of fiber hops. Because they don't collect particularly quickly. What is all that smoke? Oh, man. Put a lot of smoke up. Okay, I don't see any... Oh, no, wait a minute. No, Dandewit. That's not what's in the air. What is in the air? Wispy wheat. That wheat is in the air. Dandewit is the, da the dandelions right here. Okay, we can grab a whole bunch of these then. Ooh, are those pumpkins? Are there pumpkins here? No. But that's something over there. Spotted. I see what looks like a sunken wreck. 
Oh, no, we got no time for sunken wrecks right now. Although, I guess they could give me money. If I'm lucky. Oh, there's a ruin over there, too. Alright, we're just going to fill the entire thing up with Danda wheat here. If there's enough. Yeah, there's definitely enough. Oh, can I not hit that? Oh, well, there you go. I think the other one was kind of in the way. All right, there we go. We're practically full. Let's take a look at this ruin. The Ivory Keep. The walls of this castle made from pearl white granite would bloom in halo light across the entire Adley Bay. All that lived in the surrounding islands would marvel in its ivory-like beauty. Unfortunately for the locals of the keep, daily exposure to the bright reflective walls damaged one's eyesight. Their ever-dimming vision eventually led to an entire village of blind inhabitants that would live out the rest of their life in darkness. The walls of the ivory, unkempt, soon tarnished into darkness with them. Alright, uh, heading back home. Right there. And, oh, and look, our our story mission for Nigel and Irina, almost complete. It doesn't take much time at all to uh, get the required flight time. Ooh, a bottle? Uh, sure, we got time. I'll grab a bottle. That was, uh, somewhere? Oh, jeez. Oh, there it is. I see it. High Tide Beer. With coconut. I was about to say, we might be able to use that, but because it uses the danda wheat, but we don't have coconut. Alright, where is our base? Over there on the other side. Slow down a bit. Nice and easy. Cut power. And float it on in. All right, we are very low on fuel, super low on fuel. Transfer everything. Uh, take a quick look at the bar. Farmer Gus, no. All right, so we need to have, let's take a look at this. Uh, Dandewit beer. Quality at least one, five to twelve. So we have high tide beer. 
Anything that uses dandelions. No, we don't. Oh no. Um. Can we just make it? Like, what if we just make it? I mean, we could make a zero star. Okay, we ferment beer. Oh, man. Let's take a look. So here, like this stuff, prickly wheat and honey. Like, what if we... I don't know if we can make recipes that aren't in here. What's going to happen? Let's try it. Might as well. We're here. Let's grab a bunch of dandelion. Let's make sure it's the main ingredient. So we're going to plop like 60 in here. And then we'll grab 40. What do we have 40 of? Apples? We have 40 of apples. Dandelion wheat and apples. And we got to make sure it's 5 to 12 alcohol percentage. So add some yeast like that much. What is that? 5.2? Maybe a little more? Like that? 8.5? We're going to leave it there. That sounds good. And does this actually make something? Oh, look. It makes a beer. Uh, ferment it. Come on, Kefton. Work your magic. Bland Dandelion beer. We did it. That actually worked. And 88 units. We needed, I forgot how much we needed. We needed a lot. Okay, uh, we're just going to random this up. That looks great. And uh, yeah, finish this up. All right, we got it there. Oh, I didn't change the name. I didn't change the name of the beer. That's okay. <laughs> I was too excited about having completed this. We needed 58... Uh, Dandelion beer. 5 to 12. That's exactly what we got. Just to be sure. Yeah, 8%. Dandelion. All right. Uh, transfer. We're going to transfer a little extra. Uh, just in case we break some. On a landing. All right, let's head out and let's make some money. Hopefully I have enough fuel to get there. We're not going to make it very far unless we fuel up soon. Yeah, I understand. Uh, I did not notice how much fuel it took us to get out there. I'm guessing we use more fuel when we use our boost. So, yeah, it's right there. We might want to just not use our boost and take our, our sweet time get in there. At least it's only the next island over. Maybe we should look around for a place to fill up. Oh jeez. Or maybe it's the right option to Oh no, the fuel's going down super fast. How much does it go down when I boost? Uh it doesn't seem to be going down faster. Okay, so definitely want to boost. Cause if we can park and get this delivered, and then we can fuel back up. Oh man, it's so risky. So risky. I am headed at the right... <laughs> I had to double check that I was headed to the right place. Oh, there it is. Excellent. You even marked it for me. Alright, come in here. We need to slow down a bit. Oh, we're not we're not messing with that. Okay, we gotta be nice and easy. Don't break anything, don't break anything. Just cut the power. Ooh, okay, good. Oh, 
Okay, a little bit, a little bit of power. There we are. I hope this is good enough. Ah, uh, hey there, Barons. Did you bring that order? My hands are covered in paint. You can set them down over there. Uh, deliver. Let's take a look then. Quality one, that's what you wanted. 58. 18 gold. Oh man, this was not what I was hoping for. I might get an earful from the bar owners for accepting this low quality brew. Apologies, it was <laughs> what we had. But 18 gold, let's go. Oh, yeah, the contract. I guess that contract is now complete. Check mark. Yes. Uh, and we are super close to getting one star on what I presume is our reputation here. Oh, hey, the owner was not very happy with that last brew you brought. Just saying. Don't worry, we'll do we'll do better in the future. We don't really need any deliveries right now. Perhaps another time. Okay. Now, if you'll excuse me, back to painting. No worrying, but we <laughs> we got money now. We can refuel. We are looking great, but we're also at over an hour, so that's going to do it for... We're not going to make oh. it very far unless we fuel up soon. Yep, that's going to do it for this episode. A lot of stuff happened here. We took down a pirate zeppelin. We got the story started for Kefton and Marin. So those are the two things that I really wanted to get going, and we did it. And it looks like also Nigel and Irina... Their story mission is ready to go, so I'm going to be checking that out, I'm sure, as soon as I dock back at headquarters. Once again, this has been The Brew Barons. If you want to check the game on out, I'll have a link in the description down below where you can do just that. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you made it this far, thanks for watching.